It's the attitude that people have when they walk into a situation is what determines the outcome. We've all heard that it's 10% what happens to you and 90% how you deal with it. See, it's one thing to quote a famous quote, but it's a whole other thing to actually really think about it and integrate it into your life. So think about it. Whether you are cooking in the kitchen, are you approaching it with a joyful attitude? When you're having an interaction or a phone conversation, before you answer the phone, what is your attitude? When you're sitting at your desk creating content, pay attention to your attitude. My name is Sandhya Maheshwari and I am a transformational life coach. Send me a message so we can brainstorm and give you the one thing that's going to make a difference for your unique situation. See, life is happening all around us and how we be, how we approach it, our mental state, it clearly determines what the outcome is going to be. If you are upset, if you are annoyed, if you are concerned, and then you walk into a situation, guess what? That energy is going to continue to impact your thoughts, your words, your conversations, and just be, you know, impacting the outcome. When you're not feeling good, it's a good idea to step back, pause, interrupt this not so good feeling so it doesn't take over and become all consuming. So next time you're having a bad attitude, please pause. Make up your mind that you're not going to keep doing what you're doing because what happens to the recipe? You either forget an ingredient or you burn it. I've done it and I've learned from it. What happens when you're trying to have a conversation when you're already irritated? Well, it turns into a big argument and you end up screaming and yelling. And then I've, I, I, when, when this has happened to me, I'm like, wait a minute, I need to hit the reset button. I literally have said that to my husband. And I'm asking you to do the same thing. We are all human beings. We all go through challenges. We all go through good moods and bad moods, but it's really in our control to take charge of our life and the trajectory in which it's going. Your situation is unique. And if there is something you would like support with, please reach out. Go to beyondyourblocks.com. That's my calendar link. And I will give you one specific thing that you can do, an action that you can take that will make the difference.